Hey, what is up, YouTube? I'm Tech from Neck Nine from AndroidRoots.com, back with another kind of Apple uh, status bar tweak type thing for your Android device. And now this will work for any Android device, no question about it, as long as you're running on 2.3 or above, Android version 2.3 or above. So in my case, I'm running on uh, Samsung Galaxy S3 4.1.1 Jelly Beam, and this one is a pretty nice uh, feature. Right here, you have a little toggle type thing, and if you go and tap on it. Um, looks exactly like the 4.2 toggles. Now the toggles may look a little different and they may function a little bit different, but overall they're pretty cool and pretty spot on. Now some features there are uh, you need a pro version, which is unfortunate, but overall I really like it and it works pretty darn well. So let's say I want to turn my uh, torch, which is the flash. It does turn on right there. You can probably yeah there we go. You can see that it looks pretty cool on camera. I like that. Uh, you got GPS, airplane mode, a lot of things. And if you're wondering if you can change the toggles and all that, yes, you can. So let's go into settings. All right, so right here under a configure is where you go into settings and actually change all the modifications, change the toggle order. Now, some things require the pro version, which is I think is limited to a couple people just for develop. Oh, my bad. Uh, just to developers and um, friends and people who are actually testing this uh, out right now, this uh, current app type thing. So if you do a special unlock key, you can actually do the key, but you don't have that key, so that's alright. But if you go in general, as you can see, pro version is needed. And if you go in gesture, pro version, but toggles right here is where um, and you can do it. So you can enable toggles. So let's say I want to get rid of Bluetooth, which I never use. I never use GPS. I also know where I'm going. Oh, <laughs> all I need is Google Maps. Ooh. <laughs> well, that Google Maps does use um, GPS, so I don't know what I'm talking about. And let's remove Torch. Alright, so if we remove that. And now we go into here. As you can see, those uh, features are gone, so you can obviously customize that features. Uh, you can do toggle order, toggles per row, so you can make them bigger or smaller. So let's say we want five per row. It's going to make it smaller. So if we go here, as you can see, they are smaller. Now there are five of them per row, which is awesome. And it looks very, very similar and functions very similarly to the 4.2, except it is improved version. Um, only one downside about this is that you actually have to go down from your... um status bar and actually tap on it and then you get all your toggles that's the only uh, downside of this it doesn't actually replace your whole uh, slide down uh, it doesn't actually uh, take all the notifications and all that but still it's the same thing as having a 4.2 device here let me actually show you on my Nexus 4 um, it's about the, almost the same thing so if we go here and we scroll down as you can see it's the same thing and you're still going to be tapping once to actually get you all your uh, toggles and settings and all that. So it's still the same process, just a little bit different of where you tap it. You just have to tap it here and you still get to all your settings. And the animation is a little bit different, but overall I really like it. Very, very useful for anyone who wants a little bit of 4.2 uh, Jelly Bean into the Android device while actually having to upgrade if their upgrade isn't ready or actually installing a custom RAM or for whatever reason. This is a great, great substitute for your Android device. Hope you enjoyed this look at the um, quick settings for your Android device 2.3 or above, which will work. Um, if you did enjoy this quick, quick video, please hit that like button and subscribe in the bottom left-hand corner as I do upload about four to five videos per week all on Android. So if anyway, if you're an Android fanatic or you just like watching Android videos, definitely hit that subscribe button because you're going to be liking this channel. You're going to be loving this channel, actually, because all Android all the time. <laughs> but, and also don't forget to connect with me to Twitter, Facebook, and Google+. Plus. All links down below and link and more details to the app is down below, too. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace. <laughs>